First off, you're going to need some small rings, cutters, pliers, and your chain. Chain, and what you're going to do is measure it because everybody's head is different, obviously. So you're going to put the end right here in the middle of your forehead and just going to snip it off like that. What you're going to do is just measure for the other side. What you do for your sides, you're going to want to measure from your forehead. You're going to open your small ring and insert the chain in. Then your second one. And then your third one. So you'll have three all together in one small ring for one side. You're going to repeat the same process for your other side. Now you're going to add a small ring and you're going to attach that to it. You're going to grab your charm that goes in the middle of your head and attach that with a separate ring to the end. It's optional if you want to add an accent charm on the back. It will give it a little character. Look, a little seahorse. Because I love sea critters. I have another chain that I did as well, and I'll show you that. For this one, all we're adding are diamonds on the sides. First off, you need a long and small chain. And one for your middle. Here's an example of how it should look. Grab your charm and insert a small ring to it. Grab a larger ring and attach that to your charm. Grab a small ring to place your longer chain in first. Then do the smaller chain next. You're going to repeat the same process again. So that's the finished look. Now just grab small rings to attach your front, back, and your middle together. So these are the sides, the front, and your back. So if you guys try this out, I would like to see your recreation of this head chain and you guys could post a picture up on Instagram, um, put a hashtag, Jesenia PZ, and 